Ladies and gentlemen, uh, first of all, allow me to compliment UNESDR for organizing, organizing this uh, third session of Global Platform for Disaster Risk Reduction. Portugal remains highly vulnerable to natural hazards. The 2009 floods in Madeira caused several casualties and more than one billion of economic damage. And it's uh, furthermore, despite the promising results achieved in recent years in prevention and response to seasonal forest fires, we remain one of the most affected UA EU member states. Portugal has subscribed to the Yogo Framework for Action in 2005 and has, since then, taken concrete steps to integrate and streamline disaster risk reduction in its national development strategies. Furthermore, recognizing the importance of disaster risk reduction for the progress towards achieving the MDGs, Portugal include disaster risk reduction concerns in its development and humanitarian end policies. We'd like to welcome the midterm review process as a substantive contribute for making the necessary adjustments towards the successful implementation of the Yoga Framework for Action. We recognize the importance of accelerating and promoting a more holistic approach to its implementation over the next five years and of channeling a large share of financial resource to disaster reduction. Ladies and gentlemen, it is with great pleasure that I announce the establishment in May 2010 of the Portuguese National Platform for Disaster Risk Reduction, which we believe constitutes a firm step towards better coordination of preparedness, prevention and response activities. The platform integrates representatives of all relevant ministers as well as from regional governments of Madeira and Azores and from the civil society. The Portuguese government is committed to the revision of land use planning in line with disaster risk reduction objectives and has developed in partnership with academic and scientific communities, seismic risk assessment evaluation in the Lisbon metropolitan area and Algarve region. Additional, Portugal attaches great importance to the promotion of awareness raising activities. Several national campaigns where lunch and support is being proved to the creation of academic courses in civil protection. Lisbon and Amadora have already joined the Making Cities Resilient campaign and we hope to further extend this initiative. Portugal also remains committed to the reinforcement of the links between disaster risk reduction and climate change adaptation, and is currently implementing a national strategy which takes the two dimensions into account. Ladies and gentlemen, allow me to conclude my intervention by reiterating the utmost commitment of Portugal to the implementation of disaster risk reduction actions at at our levels, now up to and behind 2015, and comment the UNESDR and the special representative of the UNSG for disaster risk reduction, Ms. Margaret Manstrom, for the excellent work carried out so far. Thank you.